feel like something really significant happened this weekend, even if it was like just in my soul, and I can't think of it. Um... And yeah, happy Sunday. It's been a weird weekend because I actually haven't left my house in like two to three days and that feels not okay. I mean, I have socialized. I went out on Friday and I had two friends come over, Afa and Esta, a brilliant Nigerian and Nigerian American women um, writers who are very very smart and like very funny and very charming and really good people and I'm glad to have them in my life. Yesterday I spent most of the day doing like academic reading and that's why I was like so tired. Um, and also I'm also tired because I'm sick and because the cat keeps me awake all the time. I did not do any writing. In fact I feel very like creatively like underwhelmed if that's the word I want to say. Like I just haven't really ha felt the juice. <laughs> that sounds so weird. Okay, I haven't felt, you know, but I haven't felt, you know, that drive. Um, so I think I need to get up tomorrow and like really do it and be real about life. Um, or try to write tonight because I also have this other problem where I like got it into my mind like two years ago, something that I can't write after 10 a.m. So I don't. So like, I wake up at four or five and write then, and then if I can't write like that, the whole day's shot. Which feels like kind of a ridiculous way of being, but here we are. Hopefully in this series I will like get to the bottom of all of this and figure out how to produce consistently, uh, produce um, thoroughly, with discipline and joy because if it's not fun or it's not joyful then I don't really see what the point is and yeah I'm not really one to like force myself to do things that I don't enjoy I, I think I'm very lucky to say that everything that has been difficult in my life I have enjoyed to a large degree as for like film or books or podcasts or articles anything I read this weekend Nothing really stands out. Um, I did watch The Hangover for the first time <laughs> in my life. I'd never watched it, and it's really funny. And then I decided to rewatch. What's that movie with Will Ferrell and. Yeah, uh, the other guys. I decided to watch that. Um, and it's really clever. Like, there's a lot of strange, kind of throwaway lines that are very clever. So yeah, I've been kind of in a low mode this weekend, not very social. Oh, I had a phone conversation with a British mathematician today, uh, talking about um, the ways in which the mind makes decisions, and he's giving a presentation on that. Um, I must have talked to so. Oh, I talked to my dad yesterday. I'm going to. I might be going to London next month. Um, and we were talking about possibly meeting up there. I'm trying not to talk about it or think about it because I don't want to like hype myself up. Oh yeah, I'm going to London um, to give a speech at the, no, to be on a panel um, at the University of London. So that's going to be fun. I feel like something really significant happened this weekend, even if it was like just in my soul and I can't think of it. Um... <laughs> no, oh my God, this is so bad. What the heck am I going to talk about? <laughs> Almost up. Give me ideas. I suffer. <laughs>